Welcome to the Jungle Vapors. My name is Gary the Gorilla and this is Vape with Ape and we got another juice review just for you. Today we're taking a look at a vendor from Alabama, DB Liquids, and I'd like to thank Scott for sending me out the Warriors lineup to try out. It's a quality vendor that has a premium quality juice and premium presentation. The bottles look great and the price is not that bad. It's $15 for 30 ml or you can get the whole lineup for $37 so you have a little bit of a savings. They always have coupon codes so it's on the lower end of the premium vendors. But the bottles, like I mentioned, look great. They're this dark uh, frosted ruby bottle and uh, the labels come etched right on there and they actually have uh, a new bottle coming up and uh, you can see pictures of that on their Facebook page and also new caps coming up. I had problems uh, with one of the caps that broke off. But right now the bottles do look awesome. They have the nicotine content right on there and they have a nice little uh, logo for each of the juices and they have the name right on front. It just looks great. These are my favorite bottles from any vendor. Okay, let's get right to it. Let's talk about the throat hit and the flavor production, and we're going to start off with Jackie Tar. But like always, we're vaping on the sub tank mini, this time with a 0.5 coil, and we're vaping at 20 watts. Let's take a vape and let me tell you about it. As you can see, the cloud and vapor production for DB liquids is just great. Very full, thick body vape, and uh, the clouds are very nice and white and milky. Let's get on to the throat hit. The throat hit is very smooth for all these juices because the juices that I'm vaping on right now are three milligrams. So you can expect it to be not too much of a throat hit, but the Jackie Tar does have a little bit more of a bite, a little bit of a stronger hit than other juices. Let's talk about the flavor. The flavor profile for the Jackie Tar, they say it's an apple uh, spice chai black tea vape. But I don't get an apple at all. What I get right off the bat is a very nice, strong, dominant black tea flavor. And it is a very, very strong flavor. It's one of the strongest uh, flavors of any vape that I've you know, vaped on. And usually with uh, strong or overpowering flavors, I can't vape it all day. But with the Jackie Tar, I can vape it literally tank after tank after tank because the juice tastes so clean. And uh, while there is no apple, you get a very nice berry medley in the background. And the berries are indistinct. And it kind of just you know tastes like a blueberry, raspberry. It's just a bunch of different berries mixed in in the background. Uh, and especially on the exhale. But when you take an inhale, you're just getting pure and simple black tea. And uh, it is my favorite tea vape. And uh, to answer the question of would I buy this juice again, not only would I just buy this juice again, it's a must buy. I will run out and probably get another bottle because I'm almost done with this one. Okay, let's take a vape of straw and we'll delve a little deeper. Now, Strog is supposed to be uh, a very like a strawberry uh, with a cream background. Now, let me explain to you what Grog is. Grog is a rum mixed with sugar water or a lime sugar water. And it's a drink that, you know, sailors used to drink and people still drink it today. Now, do I get a rum flavor from this? Not really, but I'll explain to you why. I don't get a distinct strawberry flavor. I don't get a fresh flavor or a candied flavor. What I get from this, from this frog, is the flavor of the licorice red vines. Not the Twizzlers, the red vines. And uh, it smells like them and it tastes like it, just like those, uh, the licorice. Now, as for the strawberry, it doesn't uh, come off as a strawberry and cream vape. The cream is very, very uh, different. It's not a sweet cream. It's not an overly uh, sugary cream. It comes off as a little bit bitter, and I think that's where the rum comes in, and I think that's where that flavor profile comes in. At first, I did not like this juice. And at first, I said, you know, this is a really weird flavor. It just doesn't fit right with me. But I let the juice sit for about a week or two, and I tried it again and again, and I came to like it, and I would actually go out and buy this juice again. And okay, now on to my last flavor, and that's Sir Cantwood, my least favorite flavor. Let's take a vape, and let me tell you why. First, let's tackle the fruits. You get a cantaloupe, and the cantaloupe is very subtle, very in the background, hidden in this vape, and it's not too sweet, and that's a theme with this juice, not too sweet. The blueberry, again, a fresh-tasting blueberry, but again, very, very hard to taste. 
The reason the fruits are so hard to taste is because the tobacco is so dominant in this vape. It's very overpowering. And it's not a rich tobacco that just hits you and kind of, you know, hits you and makes you sit back in your chair and say, wow, you know, that's a very strong, harsh hitting tobacco. That's not the case at all. It's a very light to mild tobacco, but that earthiness is just a little bit too much for me. And that's why I can't get this juice again. Okay, let's take a recap of the juices that we took a look at today. And the first one is Jackie Tar, and it's a must-buy for me. It is a perfect tea vape and my favorite from any vendor so far. The next one is Strog, a nice, unique, red vine-flavored vape. Uh, it's a unique twist on a strawberries and cream. It's kind of kind of got a little rum or a little bit of a bitter taste in the background. And this one I would definitely get again. And the finally... Uh, Sir Cantwood. Sir Cantwood, the tobacco comes off as a little bit too earthy. I like the fruits. I like how they're not too sweet and they taste natural, but the tobacco is just not up my alley. Hope you like this review, and I encourage you guys to check out my new InstaVape channel, Vape with Ape, and uh, I'm doing InstaVape reviews, with this, which is kind of like a first impression uh, vaping review of all my flavors that I have. Kind of like while I vape, I tell you about what I like, what I dislike, a quick 15 second review. So make sure to check that out and follow me on there. And make sure to subscribe if you like this review. And remember, keep chasing those clouds, vapors. Peace.